Hello my friends, about a month ago on stream I played through the new and improved Archipelago Randomizer, and this week I'm uploading the VODs of it while I work on stuff for the Giant Grant Games Massive Mod Madness Super Summer Shindig starting on June 26th. This is an edited down version of the run, focusing on the interesting highlights and skipping through the things that are a little bit more boring. If you want to watch the full version unedited, then they're linked in the description below. Either way, I hope you enjoy. Okay, I think that it fixed itself. It feels like, for some reason, and pausing makes OBS go, Oh yeah, I should probably... <laughs> I should probably show them the game, huh? I've had enough of your tongue. Men, Boom! Okay, we're gonna take this base. It's gonna go real nice. Just make sure that we're targeting the right stuff. Kerrigan, like, loses to a night wolf. Oh gosh, we do so little damage. We are the worst incarnation of the swarm I have ever seen. Okay, we got this over here. Looks like we're gonna be able to take the base. We're just gonna get another hatch because we have garbage larva production. And spawn some banelings over here. No! Oh! <laughs> Kerrigan, you just killed your own Hydra! And <laughs> pushed him off a bridge. What is it? Careful with the roaches, we gotta keep them alive, we don't have any replacements. Okay, do we still- Oh, we got the infested siege tanks, I forgot about those. Those are actually what are gonna win us this game. We just gotta never lose any of them somehow. They actually do really good damage. Okay, Warhounds, uh... Hit hard. Retribution. Oh. They had detection somehow. Oh, because of that turret right there. Oh, dude, 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 dude. This sucks. Yes. I am what? Oh, because we got a cutscene, it healed. Okay, I'll take it. I'm going to send those banelings to help out Jim, but we need to... Speak. Jim. How do we... We need to hold this base, and we have no money. Valerian and Horner got that handled. We got our Zergling reinforcements, at least. Keep that left flank clear while I go put a hurt on okay, this is how we're going to keep this place safe. Hopefully Jim has figured out how to take a base now. Then bring you guys over here. Hopefully blow some stuff up. Concussive shells! Okay, go. As I said... Our ten zerglings are truly amazing. Oh my, oh my. I am the swarm. No time for the I can make one Hydra. Is that is the money I have. <laughs> I have no durability for Kerrigan. We're just gonna kite. We, uh, here's our, here's our raptor zerglings back. Oh my goodness. <laughs> this is the worst. Why are we on this mission? <laughs> uh, we can get some spines, at least in a moment. And then we have to figure out what else we're doing. Oh, we have lurkers. We do have lurkers. So we're going to use those to defend. You three guys here. This is looking all right. Uh, we're not going to have many creep tumors because if we lose the ones we have, we lose period. So I think I'm going to use them just defensively. Yes. Just spread a little bit of creep over here, a little bit of creep over here. Then keep doing little raids on this side and we'll get an infestation pit for our queens and a spire. Oh, sorry. Uh oh. Down oh, thank you. Well, we're gonna lose this base. Because I. <laughs> I got swindled by drop overlords. Oh my goodness. At least our broodlings killed somebody. Okay, we're gonna have these siege tanks in a moment. They're gonna be very important to the call. Oh gosh. It's being camped.
Hydra Ling. Go, go, go. Thankfully, we also do a lot of damage. Kind of. But currency is just a thing I don't have. Jim is sitting safe over here. We're going to have our first wave of infested siege tanks in a moment. I think we have to send the infested siege tanks to Jim to help him stay safe. Uh, I'm getting some defilers on my side. Let's try to spread the creep over here. And then I want to clear out this area just to make it a little bit easier to move around. But man, this is so horrible. Go get him, Captain. Ow. Okay. At least we got defilers. Oh my goodness. Just stop existing. I need a little bit of time to just have a dollar so I can make something. Ah. <sighs> see. Zerglings come this way. Consume, consume. Set some lurkers over here. Infested siege tanks go this way so that Jim is safe forever. Except against air, obviously. We got Dark Swarm, we have Lurkers. This is unbreakable. We cannot lose this base, really, if it works like it does in StarCraft 1, which it probably doesn't. Be ready shortly. But when you're under Dark Swarm and you're burrowed, you're immune to splash damage, too. So, hopefully. We gotta use our lame, lame income. Man, I've been playing Heart of Icer, and your income is so crazy in that game. And then we go back to normal StarCraft, and my, like, getting $1 per year. I feel so broke. What it is time. Of course, you also feel more broke when all your stuff is constantly dying because it's bad. And we are definitely in that situation. I want to make sure these are nice and safe. I kind of want to put them right here. Sky yes, Sky Furies. So our anti-air capabilities are terrible, but what we can do is we can use Dark Swarm to protect against Sky Fury. And then we're going to have our guys over here, I think. Maybe we split one and one. Dark Swarm the Lurkers. Kill everything. Yep. Perfect. So I think we're safe over here. How much damage does Consume do? 75 life. Oh. Oh, we can't do it on that. They're not biological Zerg. thought I sent a Zergling over here. I guess I didn't. Okay, Dark Swarm. And then the Siege Tank should take care of all the landed Vikings. Oh gosh, it's not working as well as I would have hoped. No, 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 it's fine. Yeah, 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 he's, he's good. He's good. More Hydras. And we can prepare to be a little bit aggressive now. Can we... Can we spawn Banelings? And then put them in an overlord? Yes. And then drop them over here at this bonus objective? Your swarm is assaulting Terran forces in three and How are we at 141 supply? Our army is garbage. <laughs> I feel like I have nothing. What is happening? I didn't do much. <laughs> I was hoping it would be a little bit better. It is time. We have... All right, here we go. How long until our infested siege? A long time, huh? Dark our swarms. The AR moves. We have no mineral dump. Okay, this is going down. 
Now, what we have to focus on next is this area, and then we need this base, and we need to fortify it real hard. That's going to be very important. I think I'm going to leave one guy right here so that we can Dark Swarm when we need. You guys over here. Oh, goodness. Oh, those Hydras die so quick. Fungal growth, 60 damage. Spawn Brulings, 300 damage to target enemy units. A lot of energy, though. Be ready shortly. So we'll try to do our best there. I bet it only targets ground. Oh, uh, let's give Kerrigan some vision range, and now she can detect cloaked units too, which isn't really that useful, but we'll take it. Our conquest continues. Boldly. Oh, I thought this was an attack. <laughs> I was scared. Alpha Squadron, destroy that damnable ship. Oh, I thought I had. Uh, Might need your help on this one, Sarah. Do you hit air? I really hope you hit air. I'm gonna try to hit something that flies with this. Oh, it hits air. Okay, you guys can deal with Alpha Squadron then. You guys come over here. We're gonna prepare to push. We gotta deal with the Alpha Squadron that comes to us first. But that's gonna be good. Yes. The Queens are our spot removal for specific important targets, which is, I guess, just saying spot removal twice. Is this is looking safe. Uh, where is... I need more Defilers. I really just need more money so that I can afford the nice things in life. I'm maxed, though. Whatever, we'll take you. It is 16 minutes in, and I have pushed nothing <laughs> for perspective in base Heart of the Swarm. This is usually around the time that it's not that difficult to win with just a normal push if you go Ultralisks. <laughs> Maybe 18 or so minutes. Alpha Squadron, more like Alpha Squad out. Got him. <laughs> <laughs> but it's pretty easy to win pre-Odin normally. Okay, consume. Keep going. Consume. We got attacked by something, but they lurked. And consume. Uh, it looks like the splash damage is still doing damage. Yeah, uh... Hmm. That's... Okay, it's really hard to stay in these dark swarms. I think that's part of it. But that was... That was a lot of supply that just got a lot of died. The 440 HP Kerrigan is underwhelming for this mission. It's really just the entire experience of being level 13 as Kerrigan that's underwhelming. The HP is not necessarily the most underwhelming part. It is time. Yeah, I'm not sure what's happening with Dark Swarm. I think I'm just targeting it poorly, but it seems like it's really big, but then when it's on the floor, it seems like it's not protecting as big of an area as it indicates. What is it this time? At least the Brood Queens are good. Maybe they can go over here and clean this. I think we just need lots of Dark Swarms because I'm doing it wrong. My boys are prepping to attack the oh, these only have anti-air. Well, that was, that was a waste. Where are the Zerglings? This is going to be a long mission, guys. <laughs> we don't... We don't have a whole lot, and we don't have anything that, like, builds up momentum. What is it this time? It is. Okay, we're gonna just keep you guys here. Oh, yeah, we gotta get more tanks. So let's free our waifu. There we go. The way is clear, Deep tunnel for the swarm queen, which yeah, better than swarm host. Okay, 
first the siege tanks go. Pride of Augsgrad going down. Let's eat and eat. I guess, yeah, we can eat Zagara. Oh, having the trickle of allied stuff is actually going to be great for that, isn't it? Because they're always food. Okay, we got these two siege tanks, which can come with us, I guess. Uh, they're probably going to die now that I think about it. That's going to suck. I'll try to keep them safe. But some of these areas are going to be awful to attack into. We just have to play actual Zerg here with the cost inefficiencies and stuff. Oh! Oh, that one shot's, huh? Yeah. Oh, we can make more. Speak. Right down the siege tank. I'm sure we're under Dark Swarm forever. Oh! <laughs> that guy got wrecked. Siege up. Go, go, go. Remember this, oh, it's that time of day, huh? Okay. We, we're going to get the expansion. Sarah, keep going. You've got to finish this. This is, this is working. Like hell I will. We're going to let all that stuff pass. We're going to use the queens to uh, try to kill... Either the Odin or its defenders, depending on what it lets us do. And then we should be okay to take the expansion. Oh, they got a bunch of stuff just chilling right here. I hope we don't pull anybody. Take all this down. What are our upgrades? 2-1. That's all we can get, right? <laughs> yep, 2-1 is all we can get. Alright, can we broodling the Odin? Oh, that's a lot of Goliaths in the way. Darn right we can. We did it. Additional starting supply, my favorite! How are you holding up? Don't you worry about us. Okay, We're Jim doesn't need help anymore. Now we can focus on ourselves. Then boom boom. Uh, gonna move these. Gonna move these. Keep this area nice and safe. We'll siege up a couple tanks here as well because this is uh, an area that gets hit real hard. Though I kind of want to keep a couple lurkers over here. They will go like lurker, lurker. You two guys want to be back here. So if we get hit by like the Reaper squad, it'll be all right. You're all over here. We got a decent number of defilers. Yeah. These will siege up. And then I think it's time to go. Every single cinematic would be better if everybody got broodlinged. Yes, it would. Retribution. <laughs> Imagine. Imagine the last cinematic of the game where <laughs> Kerrigan is in her celestial form <laughs> and then a queen just walks up and fires a broodling at Avon. Oh, that'd be the perfect ending. Okay, I think that this area is looking fine. We're gonna go find our friend Stukov at this point. How are we doing on minerals? Quite well, actually. So I'm going to focus on getting a little bit more economy. This is one of the things we're actually struggling with here is we don't have like the half workers or the auto gas and you kind of get to pick between those. And they save you a ton of supply. But we're not saving anything here. Which is real tough. Oh gosh. Dark Swarm, please fire farther. So this is the area in front of Jim. This is nice and clear. We almost have our infested siege tanks back. We're 30 minutes in with, like, no progress. But maybe we'll get there. Gonna bring the queens along, but it's kind of hard to use Kerrigan and Brood Queens and Defilers. But I think I don't want the queens that much anymore. I really just wanted them for the Odin. Now I need more actual combat ability. 
let's just run these in. Fire broodlings at what we can. If they die, they die. And if we find some juicy targets in the meantime, that is fine with me. Here we go. Yeah, I think that was good use of them. Now we can just hold down the Hydralisk button, and we'll get some more firepower. Ooh, we lost... We lost one of these tanks. We're gonna have to summon more and just keep them on the defensive, because if we lose this base, it's gonna suck. And they put a lot of... Oh, gosh. A lot of pressure on it. Oh, my goodness. Oh, dude, this Black Hammer just killed all of them. Dude, we... Wow. Well, then. That was my that was my best tool. I need a lot more lurkers here. Yep, that's just how this mission goes. We're playing at StarCraft 1 Zerg style, as I said. We're gonna lose tons and tons of supply over and over and over. My boys are prepping to attack the Dominion. Heading out in a bit. Lots of burrow, lots of burrow. We're gonna keep this safe as well. A couple guys from here over here. On siege, defiler, keep moving. And let's siege Stukov. Okay, these guys here. This looks like it's gonna be fairly safe. Until they send the battle cruisers, which they do eventually. It is time. We are without More Hydras, because I don't have any choice. Devil Dogs! Heck yeah, baby! We're getting all the mercenaries now. <laughs> it's what we need. Jim doing his thing. Stukov doing his uh, best impression of a thing. Couple more drones over there. And we're going to push with Stukov. We're going to try to make a mess of the enemy. And Oh, oh, oh okay. I thought they would all join together. Okay, well. Yay! Hey! And we're just going to try to dark swarm the area these aberrations are going. And blast through a lot. This is definitely our best chance. Take everything down. We don't care about ranged units because we're finally melee with Dark Swarm. Yes. A great place to be. What is it? Thank you, Stukov. I killed my Hydra for you. <laughs> okay, hopefully he pushes towards Dahaka now. That would be ideal, but I'm gonna help him either way because if we can take down some Menxka's production, that would be just as important. No. I don't think this is gonna work. Nah, we're gonna head this way. For the bonus. More Hydras. This area always sucks to attack into, so we can... Ah, oh gosh, they have ghosts with snipe. Fortunately, our Kerrigan has detection and a little hat. Get him, Zagara. Almost did it. Is it looking safe? We don't have anything just like left over somewhere, right? What is yeah, we literally just have like nothing. Oh no! What a terrible time to try. <laughs> My units are so bad. At least we have the HP upgrade on the Hydra, so they have a hundred whole health. Okay, so this is truly what we have. How do we have 27 units when we're maxed? We're Zerg! Okay, take all this down. Maybe we gotta bring some of the lurkers at this point. Create a death thing. Okay. 
There we go, 43, that's better. And then you guys are gonna come this way and we're gonna try again. Grab Kerrigan. We don't have defilers yet, but I just want to keep the momentum going. We have so much money that we can kind of afford just throw things at the wall and see what sticks. Oh, ow, 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 ow. Oh, I hate this top area. If we can get on top of that, kill the Siege Breaker. Okay, we got this. And then we can spawn some Banelings on top of this guy. There we go. Pull back for a moment. Try to take down some of the production. Just keep the Hydras flowing. Defilers are en route now, young Templar. We're going to move this forward. To wall off that area. And you are going to chill right here. Good. Consume, consume, and Dark Swarm. It is nice that they made Dark Swarm work in the correct way instead of the uh, Nova Covert Ops way. Though Nova Covert Ops would be so much more powerful for me. Because that one didn't care about splash damage either. I wonder if they just found a working version in the editor or if they had to manually make it. Optical flare for the medic. Ooh, that's actually kind of spicy. <laughs> Probably useless, but very, very neat. We will feast upon their essence. It's interesting that the primary target of the planetary takes no splash either. I mean, they never take splash. It always it says it does 40 damage on the planetary, and it always does 40 damage to the main target. That's just how it works. Uh, works that way for tanks in Starcraft 1 as well. So this is accurate. some of these primal zerglings. I don't care about them. Just keep spreading the swarm. What is it this time? I think we have this. I think it just was such a slog. Honestly, not that bad. 38 minutes. If I compare it to something like zerglings only, where it took, what was it, like an hour 15? I think when I did it Kerrigan only, it was uh, fairly close to that time as well. I think honestly, when I play Zerg, things feel slower not based off of how fast we actually win the mission, but how long it takes me to get from point A to point B with my units. And I see these glacial hydras and I'm like, oh, it takes so long. Even if they actually do pretty good damage when they eventually manage to find their target. are prepping to attack the Dominion. Heading out in a bit. Well, there goes all of our stuff. Try to take down this planetary. It's the main source of splash. I guess we go for that first and then spread these out. I wish he could eat himself. Retribution. And fortunately, we have pressure going on the other side. We have... Somehow we're maxed. All right. I don't really believe it. Oh. A little bit slow. Ow. <laughs> it's so nothing. Where's our army? There's a couple guys over here. I guess we can get the lurkers and bring them over now. That'll be something. 28 units. Up to 33. We lost like 3,000 minerals pushing into here. That's actually pretty impressive. Manx should be proud. Let's try to get on top of these tanks. Got it. And then try to deal with the door. We can't lose at this point. 
We have to win. <laughs> See, it's uh, it's fine. This this mission was fine. Honestly, it was easier than all in. Definitely easier than all in. By the way, guys, vote for the next mission in the straw poll. You have about four seconds to do it. Okay, maybe five. Ooh, wait, cheaper cyclones? Hey, I'll take that. Hey, it did. Not sure why. What do we have here? We have unupgraded marines still. We have unupgraded marauders, so we definitely have to go factory. <laughs> Why are there two different orbitals? Dude, there's like five different orbitals because the world doesn't make sense. Everything is a fantasy mystery land. Uh, Starcraft is an illusion. It's a fever dream. At least this mission is simple. Just don't burn to death. I can do that. Oh, dude. If we get like... What unit would be good to get? I don't even know. Why are the... Why are the Valkyries so expensive? They got a ground mode, though. I want to see the ground mode. I think that'll be really good. What is the price of the cycle? Oh, it's so cheap now! Okay. All clear. That's good. It is now safe to proceed with mining operations. That's really, really good for us. You get a starport as well? I don't know. Use planetary to defend the gold bases? That is a... Uh, that is a manly suggestion for manly men. Brave and bold. Okay, it does take forever to build a factory. And uh, This is why you go infantry and wings. At least it takes so long that they're going to be able to jump over here and grab this in a moment. Reapers, you say? Hell, cowboy, we got to train more of these guys. Hey, guess. They're seriously badass. Okay, we're going Reaper, Cyclone, Banshee, I think. Is that a composition? Probably not. It's fine. Roger. Probably don't need depots, do we? What's going on? Death from above. Depots are for losers. What's it worth? Oh, we have Stim on Reapers? Yes, indeed. Yes, indeed. That's really bad. <laughs> Once again, if we ever get some sort of medic, it'll be awesome. Tunneling jaw. What is tunneling jaws for the Baneling? Um, I just got a little bit hot and bothered reading whatever that ability is. Burrow move on the Bane? Yeah, that sounds sweet. Uh, Protoss air armor, sure. Not really what I'm looking for. Okay, Reapers over here. Grab the Cyclones. Get some Banshees. Then a little more Cyclone, and we should be able to kite things forever. This is going to be a very tough to beat composition when we get it up and running. We need some of these guys over here. Oh, that started with four mules. Ooh. Well then. That's a, that's actually overkill. We're going to mine that out in like 30 seconds. Okay, we got that producing. We got this going. Thank you, Mardon, for the sub. Cool. That's dealt with. Let's head over to the bonus. You guys here. You guys here. Seismic activity is increasing. Caution is advised. We're just letting the mules do whatever they could for a while. We actually don't have much kiting room here, so we lost a little bit. Additional starting supply, not bad. And we just keep going. We gotta rescue all of the Reapers for the bonus objectives. So that's gonna be, like, the next... Order of business. No, oh, that area is mined out already. Thank you, mules. Bad news. You guys go here, and then our little friends can go on over here. I guess we'll get some devil dogs. Can't afford the other mercenaries yet, but devil dogs are cool. 
we don't have... We're going to get the Valkyries. I don't care about the other ones, really. Okay, let's go for the space. Oh, these Banshees are so good, dude. Our Terran faction in general is just infinitely above what we have in the others. Get a little bit of this gas, a little bit of friendship. Additional starting supply, cool. <laughs> so supplied. We've already got half the minerals we need. Okay, we gotta take a look at these Valkyries. Those aren't Valkyries. They fire a lot of missiles. Ooh, they've got an anti-ground attack. Then we got air-to-surface rockets. Oh, yeah, we unlocked those. 50 bonus life, and then they land. Where they get twin auto cannons that only fires one auto cannon. And okay, these are much better when they're in the air. But they can attack move while they're in the air, which is really nice. Alright, we're gonna bust through that base, and we actually have to do it kinda quick. Hardened tentacle spines for the impaler. Unfortunately, we have the worker, not the impaler. So it's a bit unfortunate. We are shredding, my goodness. I'm going to save up a little bit for Orbital Command. I'm going to stop grabbing the money for a moment. So I make sure we don't accidentally win. Kill these Banelings are always a pain. Oh, we get a bonus for killing all the Zerg buildings? Do we do we have to do that? The destroyer, lol. We don't get a thing for that, right? Oh, uh, let me check. Oh yeah, we do we have to. Um I gotta spend all my money. I don't wanna win this mission. <laughs> Whoopsies. <laughs> Winning is bad. Loud and clear. Do you like my engineering bay collection? We'll pick up the gas, but not the minerals. Oh, yeah. All clear. It is now safe to Can I make bunkers and salvage them? Uh, no, I cannot make bunkers. <laughs> Unfortunate. Let's see, we're looking good there. We can get these liberators. Clear all the buildings. I guess we could queue a bunch of stuff up. That's a way we could do it. Yeah, that's a way to spend some money. So we have all the Reaper groups. That's good. You guys coming over here. Land and land. are under attack. We'll go fight our way through this. Oh, get them two cyclones. Rockets. Thank you. Okay, then we we bust through these remaining buildings and we get our last upgrade. Here. Splitter mitosis. Does that give you like more broodlings? That sounds kind of cool. Contact structures. Oh! Oh! A oh, chat repeat after me. Oh! That's so good. Why can our liberators attack structures now? That's amazing. I mean, we don't have the ability to make liberators, but these uh, mercenary liberators can do it, and that's all that I need. Let's see, we got a few more stuff so we don't accidentally win. Yeah, thank you, Nova Covert Ops. Insane. These should be the last buildings. Where's Diablo? Isn't he over here? 
I'll remember. Concussive shells for the Marauder and stim pack for the Marine. Wait, did we have to... Bu -bu 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 no, we got everything. Cool. We didn't have to get the money. Cool, I like that the mission auto-completes it. Uh, it was scary that we almost won, though. That would have been really bad. Hey, game. I, I totally... Hey, it worked! Okay, guys, look. There are little claws. <laughs> yes. <laughs> oh my gosh, they're so slow while burn moving. They're really bad. We don't want that here. But they're amazing. More of the swarm have arrived to reinforce your attack, my queen. Okay, we're gonna blast blast through everything. Uh replenishable magazine for the vulture, I'll take that. Don't budge an inch. Yes. Push this way, clean everything up. Nibble, nibble, nibble. Unfortunately, I spent so much time uh, with all that stuff that we're actually not going to have that much time with the sneak attack. But I think we can get the space and the gold base. That's the important bit. Also, Kerrigan is not good here, and she's actually uh, really dropping the ball with her lack of abilities. That is, uh, she's not sniping things that she needs to snipe. So we're not killing as much as we could. But we're trying. God, 40 seconds left. This is actually awful. Biomechanical transfusion, that's cool. Somehow this sneak attack was way worse than the base one, and I think it's just not having kinetic blast. It is crazy how important Kerrigan is for Heart of the Swarm. Our queens can heal mech. Bruce, uh, it is our queen can heal mech because we're never going to get more than one at a time. <laughs> we got the Jotun. I think that's a, like, mercenary... I, it fires rockets, right? I've We've seen it in custom games before. I don't know what it is. Oh, it's a Thor. That's not what I thought it was at all. I thought it was a Viking. Out with it. This army sucks. Man, I am... What is it now? Really thankful for the opportunity to make Hydras and Defilers and Brood Queens. It's just, it's really nice. I really... You know, usually you have so much choice in life, and I'm not really in that mood. So being able to only make Hydras is just real good. Thank you, StarCraft. Look at all these Zergling upgrades. Imagine if we could actually make this unit. If you stay, I will slaughter your so we have to clear, like, everything in order to get all the upgrades. That's an important bit. Can I drop the bonuses? I was thinking that the problem is that, like, this is really close, and then this is really close. They're not in inconvenient locations. I do think we can drop the final objective, though. And that'll go poorly. But it'll be a fun way for it to go poorly. Let me see. Old soldiers. Oh, if I mouse over it, it's not showing the things. Oh, there we go. Science lab, science lab, citadel gate. Oh, we have to kill the gate. And we have to get the gold base expansion for Men, unlocks. The Zerg hive cluster. Deploy assault teams. There's not much Do not assault teams, please. You? Get some creep tumors down. They won't last forever. They're all going to get nuked, but... I can at least pretend that I'm spreading creep before I get disappointed. Two, three, one, two, three. Banelings. Yay. Push ahead. Rapid transfusion, increased healing, can now target mechanical units and structures. I don't care. Like... It's kind of nice that I can target mechanical stuff with, uh, transfuse, but <laughs> it's not, it doesn't come up that much. I have the siege tanks and that's it. What is it now? And I can get them once every blue moon. I don't know how rare blue moons are. I assume they happen a couple times per mission, but not that often. 
Uh, range. There are two other Zerg Mercs. That doesn't help. There are not two other Zerg Mercs for me right now. The swarm hungers. Okay, we'll get our Hydralisk Bay. You I'm calling it a bay because I'm hoping we get mechanical hydralisks. Yes. And I guess we head over here and we're gonna go do this bonus as we Speed wait for our hydralisk cut to hatch. What is it now? All right. The Terrans are launching another nuclear missile. Clear the area. Don't worry. If we drop a dark swarm, then the primary target of the nuke will be immune. Oh. It's fine. Yes. Out with it. Get these tanks set up. And here we go. Get going. Hydra's a hoy. We're gonna lose a lot of stuff right here. But we all knew the aberrations weren't gonna last long anyway. We gotta wait for the guys that the car is gonna be like. Here. Oh, no! Wild missile! No! If only I had queens to transfuse! Out with it. I see. I see why it's good. Dun dun dun. <laughs> okay, the it's not fast. <laughs> it's so slow. When you actually, like, try to use it in action. Oh my goodness. We're gonna die, maybe? Oh, this is looking real bad. Target the medics. Okay. Uh, we got our we got our plus one attack. Let's go for plus two. And I feel like we just have to go defilers every time. There's not really another choice. They're the only way we can fight anything with this army. Stop. Stop. That's not what we do. Okay, level 13 Kerrigan, come and help. Thank you. You have my attention. One, two, three. These here, these here. Let's go to the gold base. Uh, no, we, uh, let's go do the bonus objective first. Then we just don't have to deal with this area. I'll be able to make some lurkers and hopefully just hold that area off forever. What is it now? It's kind of what I'm banking on. Who asked you? Let's get this over with. Push ahead. We are so slow. We're gonna take a lot of tank shots getting in here. The swarm never Drop some bands. This room actually wasn't that bad to get into. That's nice. And we can grab this, and this is our next upgrade. Damn it. Hey, fire suppression this system, I'll take that. What is it now? And then we have to go halfway across the universe to defend. Here, just just distract them for a while, please. Out with it. Zerglings, go! There's so many guys. Yes? Who asked you? Couple defilers. Here we go. Yeah, there we go. Fight those overlords. They're menaces to society, and you're the only person that can clean up this evil Zerk threat. You did it. So proud of you. We got five lurkers and a couple spores over here. And get supply blocked. They're gonna nuke my lurkers, aren't they? Just realized that. It's still worth it, but... Oh, it's gonna be annoying. Save yourself, Creep Tumor. Okay, three Defilers. Burrow, 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 burrow. It's burrowtiful. Yes? We almost have siege tanks again. Hey, look at that timing! That was completely random, and I'm very proud. This out with it. Here we go. One, two, three. Speak. You have 
Now, the enemy has long range here, so it's going to be pretty decent for just our carpet of Dark Swarm. We'll call it our Darkit. <laughs> it'll be... It'll be okay. When they're shorter range, you have the opportunity to accidentally let them inside of your Dark Swarms, and then life becomes annoying. So honestly, I prefer this style of fighting when we have these units. And we just build. Fortunately, we did clean up most of the guys over here. I've been playing too many mods where the enemy's like really good at rebuilding stuff, so I always get a little bit more threatened than I should with uh, having to recapture an area. Nah, this is fine. The swarm never rests. Push ahead. Who asked you? The Terrans have launched a missile. Well, that's fine. What is it now? Head up over this way. We're going to get the gold base. It's going to give us a thing. Eye of Wrath for the Wrath Walker. Oh my goodness. I hope we get E of Wrath next. Because remember, I before E. Ah, ah. Okay, we're fine. <laughs> that was scary. Warfield was not appreciative. Got a lot of these. And let's just keep pushing. Wait, this never lifted off. Kill the wounded! There's not much time. Goodbye. <laughs> I'm a war criminal. Oh no. I feel terrible. I can't believe that happened. Nothing. Who could have done that? What is it now? I was hoping we could have gotten our uh, secret unlock from that. <laughs> Commit war crimes. Did the enemy just run out of the Dark Swarm? Oh, they were trying to hit someone on the other side of it. That's why. I get it. What dum-dums. That's not how you play this mission. Hunter Seeker missile for the Raven. Wait, we have that, don't we? No, we have the regular bad Seeker missile. I guess Hunter Seeker missile's better. Cool. We'll take that. You should have left Char to me. Oh, it's the weapon. The one that does huge amounts of accidental splash damage, my favorite. Warfield, that is a very, very aggressive nuke. I didn't know you were allowed to nuke right there. One moment, please. Get these back here. We're going to try dropping. Who knows if this works? You guys in? We remember we gotta kill the gate. We should be able to circumvent most of the base, but we gotta kill the gate. Yeah, just like right here. Uh oh. Hold that hydralis button, folks. I don't know why I phrase that as if it's some interactive experience where you guys have to build hydralisks for me. <laughs> hey, it's working. Kinda. Oh wait, do we have to trigger a trigger over here to make the? Oh no. No Citadel Gate. Okay, it's just breaching the Citadel Gate. We did that. Uh, we're gonna lose here though. This is kind of Get obnoxious. <laughs> I mean, we cleared out the area. We can rebuild stuff. It's going to be okay. Oh, they got tanks over there as well. Dude, Hydras are so bad. They are impressively useless, dude. They're really trying their best. I know that. 
but A for effort doesn't really count in the swarm. <laughs> One, two, three, one, two, three. Get these over here, these over here. Bring everybody together, and we should be able to win it with the second push. Because they're not going to have much. We have overlords somewhere. Uh, one, two. Eh, it makes sense. We get uh, smoked by banshees when we're going mass hydras. It's how it goes. Hydras aren't meant meant to build it to <laughs> Hydras are not built to beat air units or ground units. They're built to turn into lurkers. Actually, no, they're built to turn into impalers, which unfortunately we can't do. Uh, we gotta get our siege buddies as well. They're gonna be important. Try this again. I see more guys approaching, but I think that we're okay with this. So uh, we're just preparing the second wave otherwise. Pre-placed defenders are gone. We're actually running out of money. This base is having trouble. Maybe I should have brought the lurkers. I just, I know that the main objective is a detector. Another missile. Drop everything. Get Banelings. Uh, tank. Siege. Oh, goodness. Drop, please. Tank. Siege. Oh, goodness. Oh. Uh. Oh, I didn't know the objective could hit that far. What is this range? Oh no, it can't. We're fine. We got it! Do you guys want to know what the stupidest thing in StarCraft is, by the way? Oh, we cannot hit these guys, can we? Oh, we got him, we got him. If you kill these missile silos, it doesn't stop him from nuking you. Which is the dumbest thing ever. Okay, uh, old soldiers, all we have is victory left. So we're fine. <laughs> We got a lot more Hydras where this is coming from. Just gotta make sure these don't get killed. <laughs> so stupid. And vote in the straw poll, guys. So, uh, thank you for watching my tutorial on how to beat old soldiers. Is this is uh, the, the cleanest method I have ever found. <laughs> so stupid.